With the introduction of Android 7.0 Nougat, Google has given stock Android the ability to rearrange the quick settings panel. Not only that, but they also redesigned the quick settings panel. So as you can see here, with one swipe down, we have access to a number of different quick settings tiles. And then whenever we swipe down again, we get the ability to adjust the brightness. And we, have, we see more tiles as well as more details. So today I want to show you how to move and rearrange these quick setting tiles as well as how to add new ones to it. So once you expand the quick settings panel all the way down, you can see a number of icons at the top. So this little up caret will shrink the quick settings panel. This gear might not be there for you, but if you have enabled the system UI tuner, then that gear icon should be there. You also have your avatar picture for your profile. And then you have a pencil, and the pencil icon is how to edit the quick settings panel. So once you expand the quick settings panel all the way, you just want to tap on that pencil, and then it will open up the edit screen. We can see this is divided into three sections. This top section is what is active right now. This second section is what you can add to the active section. And this third section is for third-party applications and ones and tiles that just aren't built into the Android system or aren't enabled by default. So to move any of these tiles, you just, you just need to tap and hold. As you can see, I picked up that one. So if I wanted the flashlight to be out of the way, you just want to tap and hold on the flashlight. And I can drag it down to the bottom, then you just let your thumb go off the screen, and it'll drop it in place. Now say I wanted the cast gear icon, the cast quick settings tile in the screen. Again, you just tap and hold. And you can just add it in there. Once you're done adding, you can tap the back button. And that will take us back here. So as you can see now, I not only do I have two pages, because it will only show eight, nine at a time, but the new cast icon is right there. So we can move this back down and can get rid of icons. So now the nearby will not be there and I only have eight tiles. And then again, down here at the bottom, you'll have third-party tiles as well as tiles that have been temporarily activated. For example, the profile GPU rendering tile is something that I, I enabled recently. And because I temporarily enabled it, it has created a tile for me. So if I wanted to, I could tap and drag that profile GPU rendering tile into the main settings panel so that I don't have to dig through these settings and developer options just to turn that feature on and off. Now the FKU, the Franco kernel updater application has installed three different tiles for me to choose from. So if I wanted one of those I could just drag that up there and as well as the pixel battery saver application has created a 
quick settings panel for me for to allow me to toggle the mesh on and off so again once that is in there I can just tap it to enable and disable the mesh you'll find a number of third-party applications have added support for this feature and that will work if you have a device running Android 7.0 or higher. And the last thing I wanted to show you is this top bar. Depending on what your display size is set at, you have access, quicker access to a certain number of these toggles. So say I wanted, say I wanted quicker access to the enable mesh toggle. I can move it to the front slot, the number one slot. Then whenever I just swipe the screen down once, that is right there in the number one spot. So it's a good idea to edit these and move these in a way that your most used ones are first. That way you have quicker access to them from the notification shade. And that's how to move and organize and even delete quick settings tiles on the Pixel and Pixel XL.